Welcome back to One Teaspoon at a Time series. This is week eight. We had our um, occupational therapy appointment on Tuesday, October 23rd. This one was at eight o'clock, um, which is different for us. We always do Thursdays or Fridays, and um, I just booked all of our appointments late last month, and so this was the only appointment that we could get. So um, typically, Cadence doesn't wake up until about 10 o'clock, and she doesn't like to eat anything in the morning. I feel like she's not going to be a breakfast person. Um, so the occupational therapy was a little bit hard because she was still asleep or she was still sleepy and she doesn't like to take anything in the morning. So we started doing meltables um, kind of accidentally. I took all of her stuff that I normally take and she wasn't taking any of it. She didn't want anything. And so our occupational therapist brought out veggie straws and um, she put a few on, on her tray and then she had her and I start eating them and Cadence started um, to eat them. She started like sucking on them and stuff like that. And so at that point, um, she told us that we are ready to do the meltables. So um, I went out and I bought a few things um, that she recommended. We have these um, banana cookies, the Gerber banana cookies. I haven't given her these yet because we ended up um, going to the hospital on Friday and Saturday, but that's gonna be another video. <laughs> um, but she did try these ones. So she's been eating these little crunchies, and these are like the puffs. Um, they're actually pretty good, I tried them. These ones are the ranch flavor, and they're both for, um, like this one is for toddlers at eight months, and then this one is um, toddlers at 12 months plus. So we'll see how she does with those ones. Um, and then on Monday, my mom had just brought over a couple things that she bought that she thought maybe Cadence could have, and it's these ones. And Cadence does actually like these. I just have to watch her because these ones are smaller than the um, puffs. So they're little like this. So these ones I'll put on top of her tray um, on her high chair like, like you would with Cheerios. And then I just like supervise her to make sure that she doesn't choke on anything. And then the same thing with these ones. These are the um, little puffs and they're little stars. And I do the same thing with those. Those, the other two Gerber ones that I got... Um, I let her walk around with them and just kind of explore and she doesn't she doesn't really like get it any get it everywhere or anything like that so um, those ones I don't really have to like sit her on the high chair um, for those because she can hold them and stuff um, <clears throat> but she's she's been really liking it so that's really good um, other than that there have been no changes um, in her diet or in anything else the only thing is like I said we introduce the um, the meltables so we're still doing um, fruits and I steam veggies and give her soft veggies um, and I still let her chew on like the hard like um, a carrot stick or something like the long carrot sticks um, but th that's not for her to eat it's just really for her to like taste and explore with her mouth so those are our updates thank you guys for tuning in and we'll see you next time bye